Okay, so here's your little happy mama. That little happy mama, we just realized, is giving birth any time now, really. She's showing all the signs that we pretty much get now from our first birth experience. And, and she's getting ready. So, to look, looking like today's the day. This one's intuition. Um, <laughs> I'm getting good. I don't have a lot of experience, but I just about a half an hour ago, we came and checked on the goats, and I had told Camille, I was like, wow, um, I think Maple's going to give birth literally within an hour or two. Um, her, you could tell by her breathing, um, also the discharge, and she s showed similar signs as Mocha did last time when I found her giving birth. So I said I wanted to hold on the other projects. We were building <laughs> shelters and just stay at the house in case she needed me or us. And um, I was spot on. Literally 15 minutes later, she went into labor. And oh, she was bir she was in labor. Right, and she, she started, started birthing. And she started birthing. <laughs> And then, um, so the front two hooves came out perfectly, and then I couldn't quite see the head, so I was waiting for that. And then the head came out, and then she actually like stopped pushing at all, and the head was just there and you could stuck. Tell she was in and pain too. the bottom of the head was out, but not the top. And then you could see this tongue off to the side, and it just didn't look right. And so I was like. I don't want to, but I think I need to help her out. I think that, you know, we just got to keep going. I don't want the baby to suffocate or anything bad. So or I- Or be stuck. Or be stuck, yeah. So I got a grip around the two little hooves and gently started kind of pulling a little with momentum. And then she started pushing more and then it all happened. And it was really beautiful. And we're so lucky and excited. I think it's a little boy. I think we got a dog off the line. Okay. Holy cuteness. Like, are you kidding me with this? <laughs> oh, Clara just took off into the forest. Oh, no. First little stand. <laughs> oh. Was it the first sound? You cutie pie. Hi, cutie pie. Hi. Oh. oh, you're so cute. Oh my goodness. Hey everybody, so this just happened. We have another addition to our herd here at the Fields Homestead. And um, everybody else, um, they were here and present for this birth, um, but they're off trying to get Yaro, our dog, because she, she craves attention. And so she probably sensed something else is going on that's taking the attention away from me. So I'm gonna bust off my dog line and cause a dramatic scene so everybody has to come look for me. <laughs> so that's what everybody else is doing right now. You're so cute, you guys. 
also um, she's either she's more is coming out so she's either going to drop the placenta or there's gonna be another baby goat we shall see Cutie pie. He's like got the milk drunk face. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh. Latte, what do you think about this? You need another name. <laughs> <laughs> He's all dark too. <laughs> Holy cuteness. This is just what's making me a little I'm like, I'm not leaving this zone until Yaro's went inside again. Babies, the lots of bunnies. Oh. Look, he's already taking a nap. 